Welcome to SQLServerRider.com. Today I am going to show you the three new features added in the SQL Server Integration Services Denali CTP3 release. Those features are Connection Manager, Work Offline, Project Connection Manager, Resolve References. These three features are most valuable for every developers who are developing a very huge ETL projects. Let's start with the Work Offline Connection Manager. Work Offline Connection Manager helps us to take a particular connection offline during our design process. You can convert any available online connection in the Connection Manager to make it work offline like this. Right click on the particular connection and click on the Work Offline option. Once you have clicked the particular option, your particular connection icon will turn on to a cross mark with the connection. This is how you can convert an online connection that is active connection into offline. This will be available only at the decent time. Once you close the project and reopen it, this particular offline icon will turn off. So your connection will become online. The next one is Project Connection Manager. Project Connection Manager is, has been added in this particular Denali release which help us to create a global connection manager that is global connection for entire solution. How to create a connection? It is just like normal process. Create a connection with the available connection manager option and choose your particular database. Then it is ready. It will show you in a bold letter like this in the connection manager. You can also see if I create another package in the same solution by default this particular global connection manager will appear on the connection managers area. Likewise you can make this unique connection that is global connection throughout your solution. You can also delete this connection from the connection manager then the map the link between the global connection manager and your connection manager will be broken so that it will not be usable during your package. So take a precautionary steps to avoid this unnecessary reference breakage during the project design. And one more additional thing is you cannot undo this particular activity while you are designing your package. So this, if you create or delete any man, uh, connection using the global connection manager, you cannot undo this step. For example, I am adding a particular task into this package and again I am going to add a new connection, global connection manager using the add SSI connection manager. This is my new connection. I am going to delete this connection from my connection manager like this. If I go and do the undo, there is no action taken place. My connection from the connection manager, manager as well as the global connection manager is disappeared. So you, we cannot undo the particular delete operation. So take care of this particular first feature is references that is resolve references. Even though we have mapped the source and destination component and the column within the package, we can still have an option to handle this particular references in the pipeline. If you right click on the pipeline and click on the resolve references, you will get this screen. This screen has uh, plenty of options. You can do the auto mapping columns. You can insert a new cell. You can insert new row. You can delete a cell. You can delete a row. 
you can eliminate the blank rows and copying a mapping into the clipboard and in the excel format so that you no need to worry about your documentation of your SSIS mapping you can still copy this references from this re resolve references dialog box you can paste it in your excel sheet and maintain your column mapping of each and every pack and again paste from clipboard option if you have the excel format uh, column mapping in your excel or uh, from your excel to clipboard you can paste those reference here directly and clear all mapping now once I click the clear mapping all mappings then everything has been split up into their own process that is in the own area input columns and un unmapped output columns if I do auto mapping the name whatever the names and mappings which are available in the pipeline which will, be, will be automatically linked together and make my process simple in this way you can maintain your column mappings using the resolve references option thank you for watching this video